guys. We're almost four miles in. All right? This is what we're talking about. We gotta be in it to win it. We're doing it. It's hot. Guys, that's my morning routine. That's my routine I do every morning. Simple, easy, get your blood flowing, your heart pumping. I do this every morning and I feel amazing. I have a lot of energy. I feel unstoppable. It's easy for me now because I've been doing it a long time. I feel amazing and I'm gonna keep doing it Everybody can do what they want to do. This is what I'm doing. It works for me. Find out what works for you. Get into a routine and you're going to love it. You're going to crave it and you're going to do it. That routine that I do anywhere I go, it's going to work for me. Any hotel I'm in, I can do that. Once I have space, I can do it. I don't have to have all this space. I don't have to have a gym. I'm just showing you any movements you want to do, you can do it. Just find what works for you and get your body going. This year, it's about being healthy, being happy, stress-free. All right? Welcome back to another video. Guys, you know what time it is. Georgia and I did almost five miles this morning. It was amazing and it was beautiful. The weather is gorgeous. All right? It's warm, but it was beautiful, okay? I had a great week. I hope you had a great week. 
guys if you don't know who I am my name is Janet this channel here health fitness everything that's nice gorgeous sexy stress-free depression free anxiety free this is why I'm doing what I'm doing okay I love everything about working out and just being on this fitness journey it's amazing all right my goal is to encourage you to uplift your spirit and to let you know this is not fancy it's not fussy it's stress-free do what you want to do on your fitness journey do what makes you happy don't watch anybody watch yourself okay today almost five miles I'm proud of myself I know Georgia is proud of herself it was nice it was easy going talked about a lot of things we shared a lot of things it was beautiful right and I said if you don't have anyone to walk with you walk by yourself okay you can do it all right couple of things this week I just want everyone to just be mindful of everything be mindful of your surroundings be mindful of what you're eating what you're drinking what you're doing look at your plate when you put the food on your plate just look at your portion okay we have a saying your eye is bigger than your belly a lot of times that happened to us it's happened to me I think I want all of that but I don't so look at your portion cut it in half and make sure whatever you're eating you're gonna be happy with it your stomach is gonna like it and you're gonna feel good when you're done all right this journey make it personal make it your own make it happy make it work for you all right know what you want know what your body want okay don't listen to anything or anyone all right I'm on this journey and I'm on it for me it's about being healthy happy this journey is also spiritually for me as well all right I get to just listen to my thoughts think about things hey a lot of scriptures I read it I own it I know it and I just love the journey that I'm on I'm gonna glow up in every way and I say guys glowing up is not about being wearing all this makeup and you know all of that and clothes and all of that no glowing up is from the inside how you feel right what you want what you know okay what you're gonna um, embrace what you want coming in your space in your life all right it's all up to you okay every morning I get up I pray I know what I want I know what I'm asking for what I need and I'm always asking God to guide me and to just watch over me and give me strength I need strength to be on this journey it's not easy okay I make it look easy because I've been doing this a long time I finally found what I need what I want I know who I am okay if you're a baddie in this squad you're gonna know who you are know who you are and own it like I said for us we carry a lot of baggage baggages I should say a lot of things from back when we were young from back home it's time to let it go it's not easy but I work on it every day I let go of a lot of things you got to leave it behind in order to grow and just be happy and be healthy you got to let go of a lot of the baggages that you're carrying for me I can't handle a lot of different stresses and all of that so I stay away from it a lot of the baggages it's gone I'm working on new things every day I get up I'm like what can I read what can I find out what information out there it's endless I love to read I love podcasts find something that's gonna make you happy I love my own time and I love being in my own space if something is gonna make me anxious and get me all crazy all over the place I'm gonna leave that alone it's not for me okay I know what I need and I'm gonna do it all right be willing to make changes don't just stay in the same thing every day doing the same routine change it up sometimes it's not a bad thing for me I must have a routine I must have structure I can't just get up and I'm gonna wing it no the day before I know what I need the day coming what I need to do I'm gonna walk my clothes let me lay it out let me get it ready right I don't like working and being all stressed out and trying to figure it out in that moment no I like it easy going I like everything nice and you know just prepared and, and just planned and ready sometimes it doesn't go as planned but I'm okay right a lot of times you're gonna make mistakes it's a good thing because you're learning and you, the next time you're not gonna make those mistakes get up 
see what you need, talk to yourself. What do I want today? How am I feeling? How are you feeling? You get up in the morning, oh, I feel good, I can go on a walk. If you don't feel good, I'm not walking today, but maybe I can do some stretching. Maybe I can do some yoga. See what you can do, see what you can tolerate. It's all about you, okay? I planned my day, I know what I need. When my walk is done, I know what is expected of me. I know what I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna ask anyone. I don't need permission from anyone. I am giving myself permission okay and I'm always giving myself grace I know what I need to do I've already taken out my meats and stuff what I need for the week coming up it's gonna be seasoned everything is gonna be prepped I'm gonna make my juice I'm gonna sort everything out and I'm gonna do me I'm gonna indulge in me okay I'm gonna try to find a nice podcast today to listen to okay I'm gonna change up my routine come next week every morning I have my routine that I do that I get up in the morning and it's standard I must do it squats sit up push-ups leg races it's my routine that I do why I do it my body loves it my body gets stiff and I have to have that kind of movement I know my job is sitting and I'm gonna sit for almost all day if I get up I'm lucky that I can walk and stretch for a minute sometimes I can't so I must do my routine I'm gonna hold myself accountable what are you holding yourself accountable to what is your routine find a routine my routine is not going to be the same routine for you everyone has their routine some people get up they're doing some yoga some people get up they're going to the gym I know a lot of people get up and go to the gym in the morning 5 a.m. get it done shower get to work okay can you do that find what works for you I work out at home so I have my routine on the weekend I can go longer harder right because I am not rushed and press for time so find what works for you see what you can do and just make it happen okay simple movements that's gonna get your body stretching your waist you're sitting all the time get it going all my bodies from the island you know who you are you know what your waist used to be doing back in the days at the parties when you're supposed to be home studying your book no you weren't studying you were doing all kind of movements okay bring it back get the waist going stretch it out it might be simple but it's good your hip you're sitting okay years ago before I started my journey I sat a lot my job I'm sitting and I swear to God my butt had the shape of the chair and I got up one day and said okay hello whose butt is this okay not mine I'm gonna do something about it so I decided no I have to get up I have to move right I'm doing a lot of exercises now so I can get my upper bottom right I'm committed I'm sticking with it okay and it's not just exercise it's what you're eating your lifestyle so everything ties in together it's a journey it's a chore okay so if you're like loose and being loosey-goosey this journey is not gonna be for you you gotta be committed you gotta want something hey all the other things you've been doing if it didn't work out try this walk when you can two to three evenings a week and on the weekend go hard all right always make it about you okay I always say it put on your best clothes come with your best self and your best attitude all right why are you so mad all the time what are you being mad about the things that you can't change and you can't fix why are you mad about it I know the only thing that I can change and fix is me okay and I'm not gonna be mad about it I'm gonna do my best and try to improve come up with new things I'm gonna try it. some of the stuff works some don't I laugh to myself but at least I tried it what are you trying today find some new things get with it do your little workout in the morning anything it's better than nothing sit on a chair do your weights just improve yourself be your best cheerleader cheer yourself on who's gonna cheer you on nobody has time for anybody but I have time for myself I know you have time for yourself okay show up for you this is a journey that is ongoing it's not one month two months a week it's ongoing every day for you showing up for you loving you it's all about you I told you when I'm out there my attitude okay don't talk to me don't stop me I'm walking I'm doing me okay I am always doing me hey I'm gonna be buying some more leggings that has the scrunchie in the back in the butt area so when you put it on you look like you have a booty are you gonna buy some scrunchy butt leggings? 
I'm buying some. I don't care what anybody say. I'm going to get a couple. I'm going to put it on. I'm going to do some video with my scrunchy butt leggings. You got to fake it until you make it. So until I get my apple bottom, I'm wearing some scrunchy butt leggings. I'm watching me and I'm doing me. And that's what it's about, okay? Whatever it takes, all right? I enjoy doing me. So I'm going to be doing that. I want to even look into some new kind of sneakers out there. I want to see what's out there with something better because my walks are going to be longer. My miles are going to be longer. So I have to improve. I can't stay in the same sneakers that I'm wearing. I want to get better. I want to get more sturdy, more comfort. I'm going to pay more money for it. But guess what? I don't drink and I don't smoke. So I'm buying sneakers. Okay? When I'm buying and I'm shopping, I'm by myself because I want to just take time. And that's another thing I want to talk about. We need to take time with ourselves. I'm going to take time on myself this weekend. Whatever you're doing, be mindful of it. Once you start doing it, you're going to see the difference. A simple shower, anything, go slow, take time. Lotion, putting on, take time, anything, okay? Do a little facial, take time on yourself. Stop the rushing, stop the running all over the place, okay? You're only one person. Your body is a temple. Take care of it. What are you rushing for? Where are you going? What are you doing? Okay? Take time on yourself. Love on yourself. Appreciate yourself. It takes time. If you're rushing through everything, you're not even going to know who you are. When was the last time you sit and take time with yourself and just look at yourself and say, hey, hey, you. Yeah, hey, you. I say, hey, hey, me all the time. Hey, what, what am I doing? What are you doing? I check myself all the time. You know what I'm going to say. Stop playing and check yourself. I check myself every day, all day. What am I eating? What am I doing? Hey, are you going to bed on time? Get to your bed. Hey, you got to scold yourself sometimes. And sometimes you're going to break away and you're going to be a baddie and just eating and doing and whatever. It's okay. When you have a minute to sit and think, you're going to say, hey, I know I was bad, but I'm going to be good now. That's life. Break the rules. Rules are meant to be broken. Break them and then you start all over again. I do it all the time. I do it all the time. I want my pizza. I want some chips. Yeah, I want it and I'm going to eat it. And when I'm done, I'm going to hold myself accountable. Am I going to eat the whole bag of chips? No. Am I going to eat five slices of pizza? No, but I'm going to eat my pizza and I'm going to be happy when I'm done. Eat your pizza, eat your chips. Are you walking? I can eat anything I want because I'm walking and I'm putting the work in. I don't want anybody saying anything to me because when I walk four, five, six miles, I'm eating my pizza, okay? And that's it, all right? So love yourself, spread love, get your body moving, get your body going. Come on, guys, sexy body, it's all about sexy body. Stop sitting down, being depressed, worrying about the bills. I say it all the time, I sound like a broken record and I'm gonna keep saying it. Why are you worrying about the bills? Is it going away? Where is it going? It is not going away. Pay what you can pay, what you can't pay. Hello, you can't pay it. Pay it when you can pay it. Can you fix it? No, it's coming every month, fast and furious. What you can do is work on you. Get your mind right so that when you see the bills, you can just laugh and say, hello, I'm gonna pay you when I can pay you. In the meantime, work on you, be happy. Get in your car, go for a drive, go on a road trip. You got some money for gas? Fill it up and go somewhere and do you. Go down on the beach. All you have to pay is parking. You don't need money to do the things you want to do. If you want to go on a trip, start putting down $20 from now. By next year or the end of the year, you have the money to go on your trip. Planning is everything. Nobody has money to just take it up and say, hey, tomorrow I'm gonna to book a flight and I'm going here and I'm going there. No, you're not rich, okay? And if you are rich, you're not doing it like that. You're gonna be mindful of your spending, all right? So go slow, spend time on yourself, do some foot care today, soak your feet. A lot of you baddies out there, your feet could use a good soaking. Mm -hmm. I said it, soak them feet. Stop going to the nail shop. You're going there every week, every month. Are you getting what you're supposed to get? Yeah, they're gonna wash your feet and do your feet. But when you're home, you're gonna do it better. Spend time on yourself and soak your feet. Vinegar and some salt, soak your feet. Are they using any vinegar at the nail shop? Do they have Epsom salt? No, okay? You have that, so do it, okay? Clean your nails off. 
cut them down short, file it down, spray some peroxide on your hands and whatever. The equipment they're using, it's not clean. They're just doing a little thing just to show you and whatever. Be mindful of it. We want our nails and our feet to be good. We can make it good at home as well. Stop getting so caught up, okay? I keep saying it, save your money for trips, all right? You can do it, all right? So love yourself, have a great weekend and a great week ahead. Don't worry about anything. Have your salads and your chicken and your fish and your steak. Have it ready for work next week so you can have your lunches. You won't be stuck when people are running around trying to figure out what to buy for lunch. You can just take your lunch back up as a baddie. Yeah, that's what I do. I have my little lunch bag. My lunch is in there. I got my apple cut up. I got my juice that I made. I have my salad. I have my chicken. I have everything in there. I'm not buying lunch. If you're a baddie, you're not buying lunch. You're buying lunch every day you are not a baddie so stop playing sort out your lunch get it together be the baddie you're supposed to be and be your best self all right until we talk again walk good i see you guys next week